So for this question, we've now got to find the time taken for the ball to go from A to T. And to do this, all I'm going to be looking at is what we established in part B of the question. That was that we had that tan alpha equal to quarter. And we also established that the time T squared equal 200 tan squared alpha over G. So all I need to do now is just take G to be 9.8, substitute tan alpha equals a quarter into here, and solve for T squared, and then take the square root. So if we substitute the quarter in, you end up with T squared being 1.2755 and so on. And then if you square root this, you end up with T equaling 1.1 to one decimal place. You'll notice I put the units in here. I've assumed it's seconds. It doesn't say in the question, but uh, because we've got lengths in meters, I'm assuming U must be measured in meters per second. So the time seems a reasonable time measured in seconds. OK, so I've just taken that upon myself to put those units in. So that brings us now to the end of this question, and I hope you were able to see your way through it if it caused any problems. Okay.